G'day everyone. Just thought I'd do a quick update of what's been going on. In the last week, this thing's been put on the road, registered, whatever you want to call it. Probably not enough light out here. Mm. This is actually my girlfriend's car. It's an EB Series 2 1992 Falcon. She's customised it with these cool decals and stuff. It has a small problem. Since been driven around, because um, it sat for about four years before being registered, this thing's got a vibration consistent with speed, which I'm actually starting to believe is probably a universal joint. Um, I've had it jacked up and, you know, spun the wheel around and all that. Um, and you do get the funny vibration, but, yeah, I'm not. I, it's not a wheel bearing because it's the wrong noise. Um, this is something I'm probably going to end up doing a video of. Not really enough light because I've waited till night time to do a video on it, of course, but it's actually not a bad car in a lot of ways. It's not bad for 400 bucks. She's done a bit of painting on it herself. Not that you can see it in the dark. It's got these falcon decals on it and stuff that she's put on it. Mm. So, yeah, I'm. I'm not really sure what's going to happen there. We're going to have to do some front end bushes on it too, because they're definitely screwed. Yes, it did pass the roadworthy, but well, I guess the thing is, they were hard, and when we started driving it around, um, the bushes sort of more or less not really fallen apart completely, but they're definitely screwed. Um, so we're going to have to do front end work and probably. I think it's the rear universal joint that's cactus on this. It's, by the feel of the noise, it's or the vibration, it's sort of down the end, of the, down the other end of the car. So I'm gonna have to drop the flange off the um, diff pinion and um, just sort of feel the universal joint, just see what it's like. But I think what's happened is the seals on the universal have gone and it's got water in there, which is more or less destroyed the um, universal joint. So that's why it's making that god-awful vibration. Um, fairly consistent with speed and it's definitely deteriorating the more we drive it. So that's going to have to happen. Um, there are other projects on the go at the moment, but this is probably one of the main ones, sorting this thing out. Um, there's a couple of other small jobs on this that have to be done, but bolt finding the vibration um, is probably one of the main ones, plus doing some front end work. Um, yeah, the front end has to be done and then it has to have an alignment, so it has had an alignment, but yeah, obviously with with the bushes the way they are, I think we're going to have to do another alignment. It's 60 bucks, but yeah, oh well, you've got to spend the money, don't you? So, anyway, this is probably going to be in quite a few videos very shortly anyway thanks for watching yeah and feel free to comment or whatever well,